Hi there, just going to take a walk around at this 30 kilowatt Nissan Leaf Techna. It's a 30 kilowatt Leaf and a very nice one. These, that's quite a, a rare thing to find these days. Um, it, proving extremely sought after cars, these. Obviously, it's a 30 kilowatt Leaf, so that gives it around about 100 miles worth of driving range, depending on time of year and your driving style. Um, this particular car has done 80,000 miles, which actually puts it in at a great value price. And it's still got uh, 11 out of 12 bars of battery health as well, even given those miles. And is in great condition, so that's awesome. You know, the mileage makes it a cheap, cheap car for what it is. Um, it's going out with a fresh service and a fresh MOT, so it won't need either of those things until the start of 2024. Um, I'll quickly go around the car and I'll point out any marks or anything like that that I think are noteworthy. Um, got a little bit of um, corrosion on this front alloy. Um, it's not actually damaged, it's just basically it's just where people have used the wrong kind of cleaning product on a diamond cut alloy. I'm not supposed to use acid cleaner on them. So that's quite a regular thing you, you see on these diamond cut alloys with uh, large faces on them like you see on the Techno. Same here, no actual damage, but there's a little bit of um, corrosion mark on the face of the alloy. Um, we've got a little bit of a little bit of a chip mark on the boot sill. I will put a bit of touch-up paint in that, so that will um, well certainly become much much less visible. bit of a light scratch down the side of the car there. I, I will, uh, to be fair, I, I will be polishing that to make that seem less noticeable. I imagine that will probably pretty much disappear also. And again, just a little bit of corrosion on that alloy. I'm sure given the miles there's going to be the odd uh, stone chip on the bumper and the bonnet. There's a little stone chip there. another little stone chip there so yeah overall the exterior wise like I say the, the, the alloys are showing typical kind of age related um, uh, kind of corrosion uh, like you see on these leaves a couple of stone chips a light scratch that we polished out so overall I think you're gonna have to say it's actually a really a really tidy car particularly for its miles and obviously it's 30 kilowatt Techna so it's got these lovely full leather seats not showing a great deal of wear either, given the, the miles that it's done. And they're also heated front and rear. Got a 360 degree camera system and a Bose sound system as well. Uh, interior wise, nice condition. Likewise in the back here, plenty of room. And there's a couple of little marks on the, on the door card here on the uh, driver's side rear seat. But other than that, the interior is pretty much immaculate. <laughs> and you've got a nice decent size boot there. And in that boot we'll of course be putting a three pin charging lead. So this char car will come provided with a lead that you can plug into any normal domestic main socket and you can charge the car from that. So you don't necessarily even need to get a charge point installed, uh, which is great. So there you go. If you're looking for a really, really good value, keenly priced 30 kilowatt Nissan Leaf in good condition with good battery health, um, this is a very, very good car. And it's here on the forecourt, ready for a test drive or a viewing. Uh, alternatively, we can deliver this car straight to your home. Thank you very much for watching, and be sure to check out our other Nissan Leaf content on our website and our YouTube channel. And hopefully, we'll hear from you soon.